Well, tear gas and tension in Venezuela. Political protests have turned deadly again, this time at a university, as bloodied students are doused with tear gas. Now there is a call for women to rally in a massive show of support for the opposition. Here's Stephen Gibbs in Caracas. Yeah, the focus of the protests here over the last 24 hours has been the Central University of Venezuela, which actually has been a center, really, of dissent against the governments, the leftist governments here, for almost 18 years. What we saw on Thursday afternoon was thousands of students attempting to march to the center of Caracas to leave the university to do that. They want to put their complaint in person to the various ministries in downtown Caracas. They were prevented from doing so by a pretty heavy-handed response by the security forces here. Now, this really is the crux of the problem, that uh, the protesters and the opposition say they have a right to protest. The government says, look, we're doing legitimate crowd control here. But many, many voices, both within Venezuela and outside, are saying that the government is being way too heavy. Heavy handed. We had a, uh, a rather unpleasant scene a few days ago here in, in the centre of Caracas where an uh, armoured vehicle reversed over several protesters. One of the young men that was caught in that incident is still in intensive care. Now, as we look forward to Saturday here over the weekend, another protest planned, a sort of variation on the theme of what the opposition is doing, which is trying to get several thousands, in some case hundreds of thousands of people on the streets, to march on the centre of Caracas. They are repeatedly prevented from doing this. On Saturday, they're going to focus on the women of Venezuela, who they say are bearing the brunt of many of the problems of this country. So that's right. Tomorrow, Saturday, on the streets of Caracas, probably several thousand uh, women attempting to march on the center of town and presumably uh, the forces again out trying to stop them from doing that. Stephen Gibbs, CGTN, Caracas.